I always feel like I'm on the amazing race whenever I film a video because I never know how long I've got until my neighbors start their construction again. Oh, there they go. Welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for watching. I know, based on the title, you already know what today's video is gonna be. We've got another US haul care of my sister, Trina! I know, I know, these haul videos are becoming quite frequent on my channel. Not that I intend them to be like the main focus of this channel. It just so happens that Trina goes to the States a lot for work, okay? And she brings me back stuff. Considering I was so proud of my last haul video when I did makeup and skincare and I kept saying, oh, nothing here is from Trina and then here I am now sitting down filming this haul for you guys from Trina not that I'm not grateful no I am super super grateful I get a lot of messages from you guys telling me you wish you had Trina in your life and uh, let me just say I'm not sharing her now because these haul videos care of Trina are gaining quite a bit of popularity amongst you guys I thought that I would make a cool little intro I am such a professional YouTuber. No. So if you guys want to see all of the goodies that Trina brought back for me from Hawaii, then please keep watching. It's basically my workout for the week. I've got a couple of really heavy bags down here, so I guess we better just get started with this haul. First up, we've got this wine. Trina got me the Girl and Dragon red wine. Now, I know it seems like she's been getting me wine on every trip, and she has, but I mean, it's not all for me. I have friends, who am I kidding? I don't have friends over. I have Nico over, and Nico likes wine, and we sometimes have a cheeky little glass of wine with our meals. I mean, nothing wrong with that. I am of age. I showed the bottle to mom, and she was like, yeah, when you're done with that wine, we're gonna keep that bottle. I just think that it's so, so pretty, and I'm really excited to try this. I'm not exaggerating, guys. This is legit so heavy. Next up, we've got probably the only things that I really asked Trina to get me while she was in Hawaii, just because I really need these. Slim velvet hangers. She got me a set of velvet hangers the last time she was in Hawaii. She got me the cream colored ones, and this time she got me two sets of 25, I believe. They save a lot of space in your closet and your clothes don't mark, nor do they slip when they're hung on the velvet hangers. And I just really love them. And she made sure to get me 50 more pieces. These are really heavy, so no joke that she brought these back. Thank you, Trina. You know you're a tita when velvet hangers excite you. Next up, we've got some goodies for kebab. She already brought us back the bacon flavor of these canine carryouts. So this time, she bought kebab hot dog minis. I already showed these to him last night and he kind of freaked out. And how cute are they guys? They're in the shape of little hot dogs on buns. So, so cute. I already know kebab's gonna love these. Now, if Trina brought kebab back some tasty treats, she made sure to bring me back one as well. She got me a two pound bag of my favorite candy of all time. Sour Patch Kids! These are the best gummy candies in the entire world. They're super sour, then they become really sweet, and they're horrible for your teeth and for your health, but I mean, you're not supposed to have it all in one sitting. She got me this gigantic resealable bag that says great for sharing, but I'm the only one in this house who eats this, so... Speaking of tasty treats, if you guys didn't know, Trina and I are coffee addicts. I love coffee, Trina loves coffee, we always have to drink coffee. So she made sure to bring us back two bags of the Lion Gold Roast Ground Coffee. I've already tried Lion Coffee before, we had a bag and I was obsessed with it. You don't need to put milk or sugar because I personally love my coffee black and bitter. Like my soul. And she got us also a bag of pure Kona coffee. This is supposedly the expensive coffee that Hawaii is known for. Like it says here, it's 100% Kona coffee. I've never tried this, but I told Trina that we would brew some over the weekend and try it together. I will report back to you guys on my Insta stories. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, please don't forget to follow me. I'll leave a link for you guys down below. I'll let you guys know how this tastes, but I'm sure it's going to be delicious. I love the coffee from Hawaii. There's just something about it. I don't know if it's their soil or their sun or their water, but I've tried several bags of coffee from Hawaii and they've all 
been really delicious. Y'all know that this wouldn't be a Carla haul if there wasn't a candle involved. Let's pretend guys that we don't live in a tropical country where it's actually really humid and hot and burning candles is really more of turning your room into a sauna. Bloom and Prosper Candle Company, Faithful Words Melon and Cilantro Candle. This is one of the most beautiful candles I've ever received in my entire life. It's honestly such a refreshing and clean scent. You can really smell the melon, you can smell that hint of cilantro. Aside from the fact that it's so beautiful to look at, I mean it's white, it's black, and it's gold, it's also got such a wonderful Bible verse on it. It says, love never fails, and that's from 1 Corinthians 13 verse 8. And of course, aside from candles, this wouldn't be a Carla haul if there also wasn't a product from Glossier. Now I'm a little annoyed at myself because I just filmed a full face of Glossier makeup. If you guys haven't seen it, I'll link it for you up here and in the description box. But I have finally completed my Glossier makeup collection. Trina got me the last product that I was missing and it's the Glossier Clear Transparent Lip Gloss. One of the first products that basically started it all for Glossier. This lip gloss claims not to be sticky, not to be greasy. It's very light on the lips and you sort of forget that you have it on. It just looks really natural and it helps make your lips look really plump and really full. I'm already gonna put this in my bag because I am so excited to try it. Speaking of bags, if you guys know me, if you've been watching this channel for a while, if you've been watching my US haul videos, you'll know that I never really ask Trina to buy me anything. So whenever she brings me back a bunch of stuff, I'm always just so surprised. I'm so grateful. If you guys watched my last US haul, you'll know that Trina brought me back two amazing things. One was from Kate Spade. It was this super cute hot sauce pouch. And she also brought me back a bag that I had been dying to have for the longest time. It was that small all leather navy blue coach backpack. I was blown away. I was so happy. I've been using that bag ever since. I kid you not guys. I've been using it every single day. It fits so many things and it goes with every single outfit. And now Trina brought me back another coach leather backpack. Now because she got me a navy blue one last time, she made sure to get me a black one. When she showed it to me last night, she was like, you don't have a black one yet. And I was just like, gorgeous all leather coach backpack. It's the same size as my navy blue one. It's got the gold logo in the front, a couple of gold zippers. It's got the nylon straps. These bags are really comfortable to wear. Even if they're all leather, they're not heavy at all. And it's got this coach monogram in the front. You guys are definitely going to be seeing a lot of this backpack on my Instagram. I'm going to be wearing it all day, every single day. I have been wanting a leather card holder for the longest time. So to match the bag, Backpack. Trina got me this gorgeous leather card holder. It's got the same black leather with the dark brown monogram on it. So on one side, you've got three slots and it's just got the coach logo embossed. And on the other side, you've got more slots for your cards and this super cute glitter cherry in the front. If you guys didn't know, cherries are some of my favorite fruits and I love how they look and this is just so cute. And it's even got a slot in the middle so I can put some cash in it. The last items in this haul are actually really, really really funny. I mean, these are a long time coming. The last time Trina was in Hawaii, she was in like a store or a mall. She was somewhere and she was panicking. She was texting me. She was like, Carla, what is your specific size in the 501? The thing with me is I've got quite a small waist and I've got pretty big hips. So it's really hard for me to just buy jeans online or to have somebody else buy me jeans. I'm more comfortable and more confident fitting the jeans first just to see, to see if they'll go up my thighs or whatever. So I texted her back. I was like, Trina, don't get me any jeans jeans. We don't know if they're gonna fit me. So please don't risk it. It's fine. I'm okay. And she was so annoyed. She was like, fine, whatever. And then for her most recent trip, she vibrated me and she was like, Carla, do you think a size 25 would fit you? There are these amazing shorts. They're so cute. I have to get them for you. And again, I told her, I was like, She was like, no. The sales lady here, she looks like she's your size. I'm gonna have her fit the shorts. If they don't fit you, we can just sell them. And I was just like, okay. Can't argue with that logic. Trina got me not one, but two pairs of the iconic Levi's 501 shorts. I love denim. So she got me the light wash of the Levi's 501 shorts. And she also got me the sort of original dark blue wash too. So they're basically the same style as the 501 jeans, except they're 
shorts. And since they're distressed, I'm guessing they were jeans and then they cut them up. I love the button up fly instead of the zipper. If you're like me and you've got a smaller waist and wider hips, the fit is more flattering if it's the button up compared to the zipper. And I find that they just sit better on my hips and on my waist. Normally, I'm a 24 to 25, but because these are mid rise, so they don't go all the way up, she got me a 26 just so they sit perfectly on my hips. I tried them on last night and they fit like a dream. The length is perfect. No cheeks are showing. Areas where the sun don't shine aren't exposed at all. It's actually a really good length and a really good fit and they're super comfortable. Levi's make such good denim. For denim that's not stretched, these are so soft and they're so comfortable and I cannot wait to wear these. And there you guys have it, another US haul video care of my sister Trina. Trina, thank you again so much. Didn't ask for any of these things. You were there for such a short while and yet you brought me back so many amazing goodies. So thank you so much. Thank you guys as well for watching this video. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already and leave me a comment down below of more video ideas that you'd like me to do. I've already filmed quite a number of videos that I cannot wait to put on this channel and share with you guys. So hopefully you'll stay tuned for that and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye!